Here's the field for the fifth. One is Southern John, owned by Claude Powers and Robert Stelter, trained by Les Miller, driven by Art Gregory Jr. Two is Erica's Message, owned by Dave Schneider, trained this evening by Brian Calvert, Tony Morgan, the driver. Three is Fiery Comet, owned by Stan Blumenfeld and PB Racing Stables, trained by Paul Blumenfeld, driven by Ron Marsh. Four is Magic Lane, owned by Jerry and Helen Logan, trained by Tom Simmons, driven by Andy Miller. Five is Sardis, owned by Carthel Dalton, trained by Lloyd Dalton, driven by Dale Heitman. Making his 333rd career start is six, V8, owned by Cookie and Moe Stables, trained by Rick Dane Jr., driven by Ross Leonard. Seven is Evict, owned by Jerry Robinson, also owned and trained by Bob Phillips, driven by Pat Berry. Eight is Aviva Derchi, owned by Colleen Moore, Jim Eaton Trains, Dave McGee Drives. Completing the field is nine, Solo Status, owned and trained by Aligio Boccia, also owned and driven by Del Chup. That's the field. You have a little more than six minutes. Trotters call for the Trotters and the gates rolling for Belmoral's fifth. Eighth of a mile to the start. Here they come. And they're off. That's Sardis going for the lead, followed by Erica's message as they race into the first turn. Sardis with an easy lead. Erica's message moves up on the outside in second. Southern John is third, followed by Fiery Comet in fourth. Two lengths to Magic Lane in fifth. Then on the inside, V8 is sixth. Looking to settle in seventh is Evict. She does in front of Aviva Derchi, who is eighth. And Solo Status is the trailer as they head to the first quarter, being led by Sardis. He leads it by two and goes by the first quarter in 30 seconds flat. It's Sardis on top by two and a half. Erica's message in pursuit second by two and a quarter. Southern John is third. Fiery Comet moves to the outside and fourth. Provides Magic Lane with cover in fifth if he can keep up with that cover. Then it's V8 third over in sixth. A Vix fourth over in seventh. And on the inside of Viba Derchi is eighth. And trailing behind him, Solo Status. They head to the half off stride with Sardis. Sardis made a break as Fiery Comet brushed into the lead. The half was through in 59 and 3, 29 and 3 for the second quarter. The leader is Fiery Comet by two and three quarter lengths. On the inside, it's Erica's message up on the outside. Magic Lanes first over third, now second. Erica's message is third by two. Then on the inside, Southern John is fourth. Up on the outside, here comes V8 into fifth, now fourth. Southern John on the inside, Gaps pushes back a Viva Derchi. They race by the three quarters, 129 and 1, 29 and 3 for the third quarter. It's Fiery Comet, the leader by two lengths. On the outside, Magic Lanes trying to gain, but now flattening out some. Three deep is V8 down along the inside. Erica's message, eighth of a mile to go. Ron Marsh goes to work on Fiery Comet. They lead it by three on the outside, v 8 closing ground in a hurry. Here comes V8. Fiery Comet needs the wire. It's going to be very close. Cannot split V8 or Fiery Comet either way in 58 and 2. In the winner's circle for the 53rd time in his wonderful career is 6 V8. He's a 13-year-old gelded son of royal prestige out of the Joie de Vimeur, Martin Lobel. Is owned by the Cookie and Moe Stables Incorporated of Merrick, New York. Trained by Rick Dane Jr. Ross Leonard is the driver. V8, as mentioned in the post parade, making his 333rd start a winning one. Win, win number 53 in his career to go along with 44 seconds and 56 thirds. Trots to a time of 158 and 2 this evening that equals a seasonal best as he pads his $400,000 plus bankroll to 414,967 to be exact suggested wagering play on the front page of the program